Hey, Trish. I'm doing fine. Only the Lord knows why my husband had to leave this world, but it's okay. He knows best. Um, I've been hanging in there. The kids are doing fine. Mm -hmm. Um, but there's something I needed to discuss with you because, um, for the most part, nobody, <laughs> you know, nobody gets in a relationship and really asks about people's tradition. I don't know if you and Jeremy, uh, uh ever discuss his tradition and stuff. Well, the tradition, our tradition is if the older brother dies, the next oldest has to marry his widow. Uh, what I'm saying is that Jeremy is the next oldest, so he has to get married to me. I know you guys are engaged, but all it means is you guys, your engagement has to be terminated, burned, stopped, or whatever. That's what it means. He, he's, he's not going to tell you right away. He didn't know his, his older brother was going to die. And it's going to be hard for him to, you know, tell you this because I'm sure he loves you. But according to our tradition, the whole family about to be up his real end so that y'all engagement should be terminated so he can marry to me. You better believe it. You better believe it because cause it's coming at you and it's coming hard. I'm just giving you heads up so you can start packing your stuff and leaving my house. <laughs> uh, so, I mean, you guys been been together for seven years, but you're not married yet. In your case, it's even better. You you don't have to worry about filing for a divorce, no expenses. Just take the, carry the ring and go pawn it. Carry the ring and go upon him and, 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 and be gone. You may, you, matter of fact, you can come take over my apartment. We will check on you. We will visit you. If even you want to be the side chick because you still got feelings for Jeremy, that's fine too. Oh, uh, yeah. People always say I'm crazy, but our tradition is not crazy. I'm telling you something that's going to happen, Trish. It's good that you guys don't even have kids yet. It's good you guys don't even have kids because me and Jeremy would have kept your kid and put you on child support. That's our tradition. Look, you and Jeremy, you can ask him when he come. Okay, you don't have to ask him, but it would take him some time to tell you about it. But I'm sure he would tell you about it, that he has to get married to me. I'm very sorry to be the first one to give you this news, but I thought I'd give you heads up, okay? Don't kill the messenger. You're going to get this news one way or another. I just thought I'd let you know and give you a few options. You know, you can still be a side chick, but baby girl, if you know what I know, you better start trying to look for somebody else to start talking to and be packing your stuff. Like I said, I will give you my apartment. I will even go ahead and pay like six months rents to get you started while you're going through that, you know, a, a breakdown or whatever, while you're going through stress, you don't have to worry about bills. I'll cover everything for the six months. Jeremy, and it's, it's part of our tradition. He will help me pay that six months, all the bills and all the rent and everything. So you can go ahead and have some time to heal but i'm telling you it's coming at you that's our tradition